Hey guys, IX7 here, and in today's video tutorial, I will be showing you guys five useful keyboard shortcuts you can use when you're browsing the web. So let's get started. Okay, the first keyboard shortcut is holding down um, Control and pressing L, and what that will do, it will automatically select the address bar. So if I am on my browser and I'm using the browser, Okay, I'm just searching things, and if I just press Control L, it will automatically select the address bar, and you can just start typing whatever you want. The second keyboard shortcut is complete the address bar. If you don't know what I mean, so let's say I do Control L, which is the, in the previous shortcut, and I type in YouTube. If I hold down control and press enter, it will automatically enter that dot com for me. And another one is dot net. For that, you just type in the website. And this time, instead of holding down control, you hold down shift and then enter. Next, and if you um, saw that real quick, it said dot net and then it went to dot com. And then the last one was .org. So if I do YouTube, now if I hold down Control and Shift at the same time and press Enter, it will say .org. And you can .org is not your website. The third keyboard shortcut is going back and going forward. And a lot of people just use the backspace to go back, but I find it easier just to hold Alt and press the right arrow key. And you can do the same thing going back, pressing the left arrow key. So I can just go through the um, pages that I've been on previously. And that's basically it. The fourth keyboard shortcut is going home. If you don't know what I mean, hold down Alt and press the home key it's right under the delete key. So you press that and, and it will automatically go to your home page. The last keyboard shortcut of the day is the quick find. A lot of you guys probably already heard of Control F. And what that will do is you have a little search box here and you can just type in whatever you want and it will search the whole web page. But an even easier shortcut than Alt F4 is just pressing the forward slash on the keyboard. And you can just start typing away. So that's it for this tutorial. If this tutorial was helpful for you in any way, please thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.